This level sucks so much balls. I hate it right about now. I'm gonna kill you, ball as soon. Wait, what? <laughs> I'm gonna kill you, grommet, you son of a bitch. You're ruining my game and I'm getting pissed. Itch. I couldn't think of something that rhymed with bitch. Maybe I'll go live stream on Twitch. I'm just <laughs> oh, God, I just don't want to do this right now. Yeah, you can totally tell that I'm a little bit happier now, guys. I got episode one done. You know how excited I am? I probably should have jumped on that thing back there, but I'm too stupid to do it. Yeah. One thing that you're going to learn quickly in this game is that Grummet is a ledge whore. Welcome to Wallace and Grummet episode two, guys. Eh, which is a good thing. Which is a good thing. What I was saying about uh, he'd been a let whore, because if he wasn't, I would be screwed right about now. So I figured out what the problem with my TV was. It wasn't plugged in. Yeah, I didn't plug in the, uh, the side that, you know, shows on the screen, because I'm an idiot. We recorded it, as far as I uh, could tell. I'm pretty sure we did. Oh, thank God we got it. Hang on. I get like an itch behind my ear. Okay, back to normal. This is my normal disposition. By the way, why did I not do any videos for a whole week? Because I just wanted to take a break, guys. I actually remember one day waking up and like, I should record Boston Gun right now. Nope, oh, can't do it. Break. <laughs> I'm not gonna break anymore. I'm gonna break you. I'm just kidding. Did you fix this at all, you bastard? I had you fix that, but you didn't do it. Now, I can easily go back right now and try to get all the monkeys, but I don't know where the last one is, so I'm just going to say no to that. Now, here's what I was talking about with the different segments of the level. There is another part of the temple, the uh, jungle, whatever. Yeah. To be completely honest with you, I used to hate Wallace and Grummet. Not the game, not really itself. I liked Grummet at the time, but I hated the animation style of it for some odd reason. Like it just seemed so weird, and that's kind of a dick move when I was younger uh, of myself. I should go back in time and smack myself right in the face and say, "No, do you understand what is going on?" This is good stuff. You're stupid. Stupid! Wasn't this like on Nickelodeon or something? Yeah, most Nickelodeon should suck balls anyway. Tank. Nobody wants to see that crap. Yeah, anyway, I'm getting off topic here. Why is not giant? But. I like the. We liked. We got. I don't even know why we bought the game in the first place. Oh, I guess they really do count over time. Okay, fine. I was wrong about something I didn't understand. The first freaking place, okay? I thought that, oh, you just use them and then they were gone. But guess not. Oh, wait, there was something uh, that I have to shoot. Shoot to kill. Shoot to kill, then I will thrill you. Oh, my God, I fell off. Somewhere, there's a, there it is. Yeah, the big giant target hitting on the pillar right there is totally not the target that I'm looking for. Post in the comments below where the target's at because I have no idea. As you can see, uh, I want to go ahead and get into detail about this game. Would I give it a 5 out of 5, desirably? I would love to, but in reality, no. It's not really that good of a game. I mean, it's not, it's far from perfect. Everything's far from perfect, if you get me honest. <laughs> I was standing on it too. But, uh, sorry, I just ran my miss. <laughs> But you have to admit, it's a really interesting concept for a game. And yeah, you could say, oh, it's freaking copy of Ratchet Clank. Well, a lot of games at the time, which a lot of games now, have the same filter of, hey, that game's good. Why not do what they're doing? I mean, it's kind of stupid if you didn't. I mean, what's the... Okay, this is when the game gets glitchy. 
There we go. I usually can't pull out my gun. It's okay. Um, it really irritates me seeing how people will always react to things like that at the instance. It's so, so, I'm not going to bring up any other games because I have like a ton of games I could just totally bring up right now that did that. There's, okay, how about this? There is one game in particular that I did not like myself, but I think a lot of people probably did themselves. So if you're offended by me not liking a game, then you've probably got some problems of your own to deal with. Why is that not breaking? Oh, it did. I don't think these things go. There we go. Now this one's not timed. All you have to do is just jump up here, jump up here, jump up here, jump up here, and jump over there. What do you think I was gonna say? Jump up here? No. Sorry. I'm getting out of hand here. I finally get to record for a while. Yeah, I recorded some games with my friend. That was great and all, but something of my own prestige, you know? Oh, whoa! He said prestige. Call of Duty. You're gonna go play it. You gonna play it? No, I'm not gonna. Where did you get that from? You even know what prestige means? Got a drill. Yay! I think you have to get them all anyway. I don't think so, but I mean, just in case. This, I hate this part right here. The stupid monkeys piss me off every time. Give them some bananas. I don't know how to really take them down. I think you just shoot them and they just go right back up. You can't catch them or nothing. It's just ridiculous. Anyway, uh, there was a game I didn't really like when I first played it. Uh, it was because it felt too... I'm gonna hate myself for saying this. Too Ratchet and Clank, too Jack. It had that same... No, I liked that. I liked the... I'm like, oh, it does a high jump and long jump too. You know, that's a pretty well, a common method of gaming. I know there was a game out for all that that did high jumping and stuff like that. But you, you know what I'm talking about. The, the fact of holding something down while you know and running, doing long, stretch jumping, whatever you want to call it. And yeah, Ratchet and Clank, you could say, was copy on Jack and Daxter, but no. Naughty Dog gave Insomniac the engine to run Ratchet and Clank. So obviously they're going to use some of the same methods as it was before. You guys need to get your research done, even though nobody was probably even saying this in the first place. For this coin. This, okay, back to topic. I was going to tell you another one. This area reminds me of Bonacle Heroes, War of the Jungles. Oh, I'm going to play that game someday. Anyway, the game was called Vex, V-E-X-X, -X, and it really was a Christ Satan of Hell to me. I did understand it, okay? Like, you collect these hearts, like real beating hearts, <laughs> which is funny, but yeah, I, I'm weird, I know, deal with it. It was like a uh, collector horror game, and I could not, in the life. like, you use your claws to beat things up, I guess, you do long jumps, high jumps. I guess. You do things, I guess. You do average, usual uh, platformer things, you say. Like uh, comedies of, well, I don't know. Hey, I gotta get from one side to another. Let's do this. What the? F yeah, my own uh, people are against me now. I'm the turd monkey. And all of them are against me. All those monkeys are just not satisfied with my delusion of consequence here. Like this. You'll all be tried and beaten. Massively. Well, I'm gonna get a file complaint and Pete for saying that. Okay. But I did not like like a lot of people were like, oh I like this game, I like this game. I tried it twice! I swear to god, I went back and tried it again. I'm like there's obviously something I'm missing here. There's some kind of point that I'm not understanding. What was I still wrong? I don't understand. Like, I was so confused about it. It didn't really hit me at all. Never. Never did it do that. It never was like, oh, this is a good game. No, it was like, oh, this is a good game. <laughs> it didn't really make me happy. It wasn't anything that I liked. But it had all the same concepts as what I like. I like Jack and Daxter. I liked uh, Ratchet and Clank, you know. I liked those games, yeah. But it wasn't anything the same. It was his own stupid version of it. I think I probably lost a few IQ just saying that. Just saying the word stupid makes me lose IQ. <laughs> oh, I love this game. 
It's so... Humorous! <laughs> Just it's so funny, like, it has its own charm to it, and I love it. And that's what I love about Wallace and Gromit. Uh, there are very few games out there that have this same style of humor as this. Obviously, it takes the humor from the show, you know, the childish... Childish? No. The kind of kid-friendly humor, where it's like... No, it's really blowing up or anything. <laughs> uh, it's more of like, oh... Wallace gets scared by an elephant. Wallace forgets to tie his shoes and falls down the stairs. It's funny humor. Now, if you want to know a really funny show, freaking Tom and Jerry. I was going to watch that the other day, too. I forgot about it. Dang it. I wanted to go back and try to watch some of the old episodes on YouTube. I remember talking about that one, my, one of my last few um, of Jack. I'm like, oh, Tom and Jerry was funny as shite. Hell, yeah, it was funny as shit. Jeez. I don't know about that, if that's love or not, so don't ask me. Well, you didn't ask me in the first place. Did you? I just want to go ahead and say this now. There's a lot of Let's Plays I want to do on my channel. So be prepared to see a few things. I'm not going to be like all out balls out, like every day recording something. Fix it. Oh, let's cheese. Call him Grummet. We'll call him Growlitz. And we'll call him Womit. Oh yeah, this part. Uh, there are two things in this part. Two coins you can get. First of all, to show these stupid monkey bastards. I told you again, the signs do change via level, it seems. Or part of level. You'll get a coin wherever that will spawn. Do we not shoot a monkey? I think we just grab... No, we don't. How do we get this to go? Oh, I think this is, oh, there's a monkey. He's hiding like in the, the darkness. Eternal darkness. Oh, boy. Like me, I am really loving this recording right now. Oh, my God. Like the first episode was bleh, so like. Uh... Oh, yeah. By the way, I'm going to continue Big Mario. If anybody's watching Big Mario and you're trying to figure out what the hell's going on. Nope. No, Big Mario. I'm sorry. It's just... It's so... It's story driven, really. And I love games like that. But it, it's it's long and I can't really do a game that that's entirely like maybe a hundred or eighty episodes. Oh, but you can do Batman just fine. That's like probably what, sixty, fifty episodes of Batman RPG? You get everything? I guess so, but I lost my feel of entertainment in the game because one, I just don't like the Wii. I mean I like the console idea, I like the console itself. I don't like the Wii most, that's damn sure. If I could play with like a classic controller or something, anything. Now the thing is with Paper Mario, they didn't say, Oh hey, you know, for your cut dog. Guess what? Your controller's about to die. No, you have to go save it, and it's like, oh you know what the you mad? It's like, yes, I'm freaking mad. You tell me earlier. With Red Still 2, which is also a game I did a long long time ago on my channel, should still be up. And got copyrighted for a few things, but we're not gonna get into the detail on that. That was just whatever. That was Ubisoft being Ubisoft, like they always are. Uh, I didn't really take it down because of copyright. I just said, uh, well, what's the point of doing it if the stupid controller is so messed up? Now, I want to show you something strange. My, my first time doing this, my facial reaction was so funny. It was priceless. If I could, like, actually... Have like a web. I could. I, I could do webcam. I just don't want to. You guys don't want to see my ugly ass face, do you? Go on twitch.tv.com and then go check out my Jack and Dexter speedrun. <laughs> yeah, you want to know what I did with Jack after I got done with it? I speedrunned it. Ah, uh, yeah. You know what I made? Two hours and 34 minutes of an 80% speedrun. Bail? Yes. Good? Yeah, okay. For my first time. That's my first speedrun ever actually fully completed. Back in the day when I used to play games, I used to be like, oh, I can see run this. I'm just going to run through this. It's too fast. And then, you know, when I, like, actually time myself, it's ridiculous. I made that. I know I did. Now what I hate is you have to actually jump right back right into that. <laughs> Got it. Okay, we're good. Oh, I thought they'd be nice enough just to give it to us. When I jumped in there, I guess, nah, this is stupid. Why would you ever do that? I'll see you guys in the next video. Then we'll probably head off and they'll shoot this bird. I don't know where it's going, little bastard. Get back here, you little flea-ridden 
monkey spank. I don't know anymore. Words. Don't listen to my words of wisdom. You won't. What are we going to do in the next episode? I don't know. What are these blocks for? We'll find out. Bye.